John Ryan Scharfer is a founding member of the Oath Keepers and an American heavy metal musician. He is best known for his role in the 2021 storming of the United States Capitol, when in April of that year he became the first person to plead guilty to federal crimes in connection with that attack. Before his criminal notoriety he was mostly known as the rhythm guitarist and principal songwriter of the Florida-based heavy metal band Iced Earth, which he formed in 1985 under the name Purgatory. He also sings in his side project Sons of Liberty and played guitar for Demons and Wizards. His collaboration with Blind Guardian frontman Hansi Kirsch before the partnership's end in 2021. Following his criminal charges, Schaffer was originally introduced to rock music at the age of three. His older sister introduced John to bands such as Black Sabbath, Deep Purple, Alice Cooper, and Blue Oyster Cult. In 1979, at the age of 11, Schaffer attended a KISS concert with his father. Since then, he has said that this was the moment when he realized what he wanted to do for a living. Schaffer went to a Lutheran school for five years during which he developed a lot of anger and rebellion, due to the abusive nature of the pastors. Allegedly, on one occasion, one of the pastors shoved a bar of soap down Sharfa's throat, because the pastor felt threatened by his refusal to submit, after he could not answer Sharfa's questions about evolution versus creationism. According to Sharfa, this had an effect on him forming a band, so that he could prove these people wrong. In 1984, at the age of 16, Schaffer moved to Tampa, Florida. Shortly before he left, one of Schaffer's childhood friends died in a motorcycle accident, which made Schaffer even more determined to move to Florida and start a band. While in Tampa, Schaffer slept in his car until he nearly lost his life in a car accident, after which he got an apartment and a job as a roofer. In 1984, Schaffer formed a short-lived band called The Rose. The band quickly broke up, after which John formed what would later become Iced Earth, under the name Purgatory on January 20, 1985. Schaffer played rhythm guitar and also designed the band's logo. The logo had originally been used for The Rose, but after the band broke up, Schaffer reused the logo for Purgatory and later for Iced Earth. In 1990, after some lineup changes, the band, now known as Iced Earth, released their self titled debut album. In addition to playing rhythm guitar and singing backing vocals, John also acted as co producer on the album. As he has done on all Iced Earth albums since the following year, the band released the follow up album, Night of the Storm Rider, which also featured John singing lead vocals on the song, Storm Rider. After some downtime between 1992 and 1995, Iced Earth re-emerged with a new lineup, which included singer Matt Barlow, who would stay with the band until 2003. The band released the albums Burnt Offerings and The Dark Saga in 1995 and 1996 respectively. Until in 1998, Iced Earth released the album Something Wicked This Way Comes which featured three songs that were based on John Scharfer's Something Wicked concept. The songs tell the story of a character that John created, called Set Abomine, who also appears on the album's front cover. After Something Wicked This Way Comes, Iced Earth released the album Horror Show in 2001, after which work began on the follow-up album, The Glorious Burden. Originally Matt Barlow had recorded the vocal tracks for the album. But due to his lack of interest in the band following the events of 9-11, he left the group in 2003 and joined the Georgetown Police Department in Georgetown, Delaware. Matt was replaced by former Judas Priest singer Tim Ripper Owens, who re the entire album. The Glorious Burden was released in January 2004, after which John started work on two concept albums based on his Something Wicked storyline. The first album, Framing Armageddon, Something Wicked Part 1 was released on September 11, 2007, after which, in December 2007, it was announced that Matt Barlow would be returning to Iced Earth. The second album, The Crucible of Man, Something Wicked Part 2, was released September 5, 2008, and featured Matt once again on vocals.
In 2011, after about two years back in the band, Matt Barlow issued a statement saying that he was leaving Iced Earth in order to spend more time with his family. Matt Barlow was later replaced by Stu Block from Into Eternity, who had opened for Iced Earth in 2008. With Block, the band recorded the album Dystopia, which was released on October 17, 2011. From October 2011 to December 2012, Iced Earth toured in support of Dystopia, during which time they recorded the album live in ancient Korean. Demons and Wizards as a side project Sharfa put together with Blind Guardian frontman Hansi Kirsch. Schaffer and Hansi had originally met in the early 1990s, when Iced Earth and Blind Guardian toured Tog.